uh, another day of school and it's such a lovely day. I wonder if little Carly's here already. Oh wait, I think she might be on a date with Scuba Steve and she got permission to be off school because it was some educational trip or something. I'm not sure. But anyway, let's see what's going on. I wonder if little lizard and tiny turtle will be here. Oh, I better check the notice board. Let me see. Class president. Think you got what it takes? Class elections today? Oh my gosh, that's so cool. I wonder who's gonna run for like class president. That is such an awesome title, but I guess it has to be someone who's like super nice and listens to everyone and tries to help everyone. Oh no, is that the time? I'm totally gonna be late and Tiny Turtle is gonna give me detention. I better get to class, but then I'll get all the details after this class, see who's gonna run. Oh my gosh, this could be so awesome. All right, and in we go. <gasps> There's the bell, okay. Uh, so, I was thinking in that class, you know what? I could be a great student body president. I mean, why not me? I've been in Minecraft school for a long time now. I know everybody. I think everyone trusts me. I mean, Tiny Turtle and Little Lizard know me very well. So I have a teacher who knows me. The principal knows me. I mean, I feel like all the students like me. Maybe not Big Bad Barry the bully, but I mean, it doesn't really matter what he thinks. But okay, let me just think really, really long and hard about this. Do I really want to be class president? I mean, it is a lot of responsibility. You are representing your whole class for the opinions that they want to better in the school. And I mean, if people have problems, they can come to you. And there's just a lot of stuff like that that I have to consider. But I feel like I might be able to handle it. But I'm going to have to know the issues of the people in the school before I can commit to it. Um let me think uh, okay uh, hey there um i was just wondering if you could change anything about minecraft school uh what would it be i love minecraft school but i guess one thing i would change is the fact that the faculty don't listen to what the students want hmm that is a very fair point i mean some things are just not fixed around here and the teachers and the principal they don't listen to us students okay well that was a valid point thanks for your time um okay so I guess if I was class president, I could fix that. Um, let's go talk to someone else. Uh, hello there. Um, excuse me. Sorry. Uh, I just need a moment of your time. Uh, uh, sir? Oh, oh, thank you. Um, what would you like... Dude. Man, I was talking to you. Okay, he obviously just doesn't want to talk to us today. Uh, what about you, sir? Uh, what would you change about Minecraft school? There's a lot of litter thrown around the school. I know there was hall monsters before, but the littering has gotten worse. Oh, okay, so the littering is a big issue still. Okay, I remember when me and little Carly and little Lizard were hall monitors. I mean, we did kind of clean up the litter issue, but I guess it's coming back. That's something to know, because then I could maybe start like a cleanup policy where there is more hall monitors or there's definite um, detentions for if you're seen littering straight away okay uh okay we've talked to two boys let's talk to a girl uh hello there um what would you like to see change in minecraft school i'd like to see stricter policies on bullying in minecraft school i mean it's not particularly me but there's some kids who are getting picked on and it's really not cool Wow, that's a really, really good one, actually. Stricter policies on bullying. Okay, um, have I anything to write this stuff down? Okay, yeah. Okay, so the first guy says, uh, teachers don't listen. Uh, second guy said, oh, what was the second guy said? Mm, oh, the litter, litter problem, so the rubbish and the trash. And then the third girl said the bullying. Okay, so that's good. That's three things. Okay, uh, let's see if anyone else is around who we can ask. Maybe another girl. Oh, there, here is a girl. Um, hey there. Um, I'm thinking about running for class president, and I was wondering, is there any issues in Minecraft school I should know about, or anything that you would like to see in a class president, or anything like that? Yeah, I totally think things should be more equal between boys and girls in this school. I think the guys get handed a lot of opportunities to be hall monitors and stuff like that, and the girls don't really get the same. I mean, it's the same when it comes to sports. It's just not fair. Take a look around. All these guys get to do whatever they want. Wow, I didn't realize it was that bad. I mean, I guess I never really noticed, because in my class, Tiny Turtle, he's really, really equal about everything between boys and girls. We all get treated the same. But um, that's a really, really good point. I'm going to write that down. So gender equality. Okay, that is a big one. So there we go. 
Okay, well, thank you very much for your time. Okay, guys, I think I have enough points here to go on. Maybe we should ask one more person. Is there anyone around? Oh, this guy. Uh, hello, sir. Have you got a moment? Oh, thanks. Um, I was just wondering, what do you look for in a class president? In a class president, I would like to see someone who cares about what the students have to say and will make changes in the school for the better. You know what? You're right, and I think I'm the girl for the job. Okay, so now that I have some points that I know what's going on... Oh, what's that noise? Attention all students. Anyone running for class president will have to give a speech in the auditorium at the end of the day. Then students will be able to cast their votes and vote for their new class president. That is all. Oh, a speech in the auditorium. Oh gosh, that's kind of scary. There will be a lot of people there. Um, okay, well, I have to get my act together. First, I'm going to have to make election posters. Okay, um, okay I'm going to need to get some supplies. I think there's a supply room upstairs that we can use. And we can make some really awesome posters. Okay, uh, let's see. Uh, paper supplies, that'll do. So we need to go in here. Okay, let's get some paper and start making some posters. There. The last poster I made is up. I think it's pretty cool. It says, vote for little Kelly. It's got some flowers. It's got some footballs. It's got boy side, girly side, and then a picture of me. I think that's pretty cool. But let's go take a look around the school and see who else has put up posters. I mean, wait a second. The Hulk? The Hulk is running for class president? What? He's so popular, though. Oh, my gosh. Everyone's going to vote for him. And then no one will vote for me. Okay, well, there's another one of mine. Let's see how many Hulk has put up. Okay, there's another one of mine. Okay, looks looking good for me. It looks like I put up more posters anyway. And there's another one of Hulk. It doesn't even say vote for Hulk. It just looks, it looks like Hulk angry. But I guess, I guess that's how everyone knows Hulk. I mean, it's kind of crazy. Look, there's another one of Hulk. There's one for me. One for Hulk. One for me down there. And another one for Hulk down there. Oh gosh, that guy's like looking at it. Oh, please vote for me, please. Okay, um... So I guess it's just me and Hulk for, for class president. And later on, I'm going to be in the auditorium giving a speech. And Hulk is going to be there too. And hopefully someone votes for me. Oh my gosh, I really hope I get this now. But how can I convince people to vote for me? Uh, maybe I should give them a little treat. Just before I go and give them a speech at the end of the day. Okay, I'll go into the cafeteria and I'll make some cakes. And I'll hand them out and say, vote for Keddy. Okay, let's do that. Okay, that's 11 cakes, but if I'm going to stand a chance, 11 votes aren't going to be enough. I'm going to need to make some more cakes. Okay, let me see. Okay, let's take a couple more eggs. Let's do another, like, four cakes. That'll make it 15. That'll be good. Okay, so then... One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, that's enough wheat. Then milk. Oh, gosh, we're going to need one, two, three. The same again. Okay, there we go. And sugar. We're going to need two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, and let's see if we can make some cakes now. All right, so we're going to put our egg in the middle like we just have been doing. We're going to put milk all along the top wheat all along the bottom and some sugar either side awesome there's another one okay so let's quickly do the rest of them here and then we got to make our way to auditorium school day is almost up and if we want to get anywhere with this we have to have our speech prepared and we need to be calm collected and ready to give the biggest speech of our life i mean it's gonna be crazy okay uh let's do that again and we're gonna have to keep on putting the milk in one by one. So there's another cake and just one more. Let's see. And there we go. Okay. There's 15 cakes. Okay, let's go give them out and tell people to vote for little Kelly. Okay, uh, here you go. Um, vote for little Kelly. She listens to the people. Um uh, hello there. Uh vote for your pal uh gal. She won't let you down. There you go. I'm not very good at the slogans. Um, girl power, vote for me, please. Um, uh, I I'm going to get rid of all the litter issues. I'm going to stop bullying. A vote for me is a vote for equality. Okay, um, yeah. Okay, let's keep on giving these out. There you go. Uh, to the girl down the hall. Uh, there you go. Okay, uh, let's hand the rest of these out. And then we'll go to the auditorium and start preparing for our speech. Because it looks like the students are heading that way now. And the sun's starting to go down. Okay, vote for little Kelly, guys. Thanks. 
Okay, it's time. It's time to give my speech. Okay. Oh gosh, everyone's already here. Um, oh look, some people from class are here. Timmy and the minions and everyone else as well. Oh, there's Sarah over there and Andy. Uh, Hulk's already up here. Oh, oh, okay. Um, oh, I don't know who that is. I wonder who she is. Hello, students. I'm glad you all came today. Today is the day we elect the class president. I am the head of student relations, so I'll be keeping track of all the votes, etc. But first up, Hulk, you are going to give your speech first. Oh, okay, uh, okay. Uh, Hulk, I just want to say good luck. I hope you give a great speech, and I know you'll do great. Okay, uh, I guess it's time. Hulk smash! Hulk win! Um... That was a great speech, Hulk. Uh, thank you very much. Okay, uh, hold your applause, guys. Next up is little Kelly. Wow, okay. Even Cap is standing on his feet for Hulk. I guess they all really like him, but it's my turn, okay? Um, okay, here we go. Hello guys, um, my name is Little Kelly. Some of you may know me, some of you may not, but I am a student here at Lizard. Oh gosh, I'm so nervous. Sorry. I am a student here at Little Lizard High. I've come and spoke to a few of the students today to find out the issues. There were issues such as the faculty don't listen to the students. There's a lot of littering in Little Lizard High. There's some bullying and definitely some gender equality. And I just want to let you know that I know that if you liked my friend and my opponent, the Hulk, he is a great guy and he'll be able to solve some problems. But I am actively going to go and get more issues sorted for all of you guys. Anything else that I've missed, I promise as class president, I will do it for you. And I'll always be here to listen to you guys, even if it's not a school problem, even if you just want to talk. So, um, yeah, I hope you vote for me and thanks for listening, guys. Great job, Little Kelly. I know it can't be easy to get on stage and express your opinions, but guys, it's now in time for voting. Please cast your votes quickly and quietly, and then we can announce the winner. And the results are in. The new class president of Little Lizard High School is... Little Kelly! Congratulations, Little Kelly! Oh my goodness, I won. Oh my gosh. Uh, I just want to say thank you all so much for coming and hearing me and my lovely opponent, the Hulk. He is great as well. And you guys don't forget that. But oh my gosh, I can't believe you've elected me class president. That is so cool. Thank you all so much. And I promise I will stick to everything that I've said I'll do. And I'll get it done to make Little Lizard High the best school in the world. But guys, let's go celebrate. Let's go have a party. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Minecraft School where I, Little Kelly, became the class president. It's so cool. I'm going to try and make the school a better place for everyone. But, guys, if you've enjoyed this episode, make sure to leave a like and a comment. Comment below saying congratulations, class president, because that was so awesome. And, yeah, if you want to subscribe to my channel, just click the button. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter as well. The links will all be down below. And don't forget to check everyone else out in the little club, too. They've got some awesome video guys and the links will be down below to all their channels too but until next time you guys see you again soon